Thank you, Mr. Chairman. It uh, is an honor to be here tonight with so many esteemed guests and so many individuals welcoming this important chamber. Uh, thank you, uh, Council General Harish, for, for being here and for your leadership in Texas uh, for these many years. Uh, thank you um, to uh, our, our uh, President of the Dallas Chamber, uh, Dale uh, Petrosky, my partner, uh, uh, Deputy Mayor Pro Tem Eric Wilson, the city, we welcome you. We welcome all of you to do that. And you know we are in tall cotton because the governor's here. Our great governor, uh, uh, Greg Abbott, thank you so much for coming to Dallas. It's important. And for those of you that uh, are going to be receiving your awards tonight at the 16th Annual Awards Banquet, congratulations to you for your accomplishments um, and for your leadership in this city. A half a day away, 11 and a half, 12 hours, is this place called India, from Dallas. It feels like that's a long way away, around the globe. But in so many ways, it is so close. Because the Indians in the Dallas-Fort Worth area have demonstrated that we are one of a kind in many ways. Our belief in democracy and the rule of law is remarkable. Our belief in family is remarkable. Our belief in education is phenomenal. The average Indian here in the Dallas-Fort Worth area, I just learned, has a bachelor's degree. The importance of business in IT and healthcare is fabulous. And knowing how to make some money is good too. But it doesn't stop there. Your belief in spirituality is something that we in the United States need to understand better. I saw it with your Diwali festival at Fair Park. It was a great, great festival. And last but not least, something that is so very important to me, your belief in giving back is a hallmark of this community. A.K. Mayo is a good example of that. Congratulations to your recent appointment, Mr. Mayo. Thank you. And it's not so far away because we get more and more Indians in Dallas-Fort Worth every day. 10% growth in this, uh, in this uh, community in Dallas-Fort Worth. I'll take any business that grows 10% every day. And it is uh, more than any, any other community that is growing in this area. Over the past decade, trade has increased by 35% between our region and India. And our exports to India have increased by 76%. It's just phenomenal. We should be celebrating, but we have much work to do. We must put Dallas-Fort Worth in this great state of Texas on the map throughout South Asia. Dallas-Fort Worth has so much to offer. I go and I visit countries and I tell them, that we are the fourth largest market in the United States. You have New York area, Los Angeles, Chicagoland, and then Dallas-Fort Worth. And I said, we're the number one technology uh, uh, employer in the state of Texas. And I said, if you want the best of Texas, you come to Dallas. Because of our, our thriving neighborhoods, our diverse communities, our strong economy, our low unemployment, our low business regulation, 
We have been able to attract companies, Fortune 500 companies. I've been with Governor Abbott uh, pitching our state and our city. No one tells the story better. We have a lot to offer, and I ask you to be our sales reps as you go out in the community to bring more and more companies to our region. Now, the good news is, yes, it's a half a day away, but now we're getting there so easy. I was just in Abu Dhabi, the headquarters city of Etihad, and now it's so easy to fly to India. So easy. You get on a beautiful jet, and you're one stop away to any of the cities in India. That was a huge moment for this market, a great moment for the Indian community, and it has been a growth act, uh, uh, a machine for Etihad with over 50% of their passengers on, on all the three Gulf carriers are coming from India. And so I am betting on this community for the future because I believe we will continue to grow our city through you. You will teach us many things and we will be partners in others. So I thank the U.S.-India Chamber of Commerce for what you've done. The board members, the representatives, know that you have a friend at City Hall and myself, and I will be your biggest advocates as you grow your families, your lives, and your businesses. God bless you. Thank you.